Well, hello there again. It's Miss Cool Cat 14. I've well, well, she's me from well, you see me for the first time. Well, not the first time, but really in front of this camera. Um, I seem to misplace my camera, so I'm doing it this way so you can show. I can show you what I have. Pretty weird to be exact. Um, I had a kind of a dull review with uh, Karma, and I think she's coming up right now. Um, well, she was collecting these stuffed monster eye dolls, and so her mum went back to a store where she got her other two stuffed dolls, and in the shop they had everything for five euros, and well. I've never seen something like this. In the series, you hear them talk about something that's called an eye coffin. And well, I got an eye coffin. And yeah, it's pretty interesting seeing something like this, if you know what I mean. An eye coffin. Wow. And so, yeah, this is it. It's well, everything on the box is German, and I live in the Netherlands, and I can't read any of it. <laughs> so, yeah, I can't really tell you what's on the box. But this is the front, and, well, it looks pretty cool. This is back. Yeah. I find it very interesting, this <laughs> AI coffin. How cool is that, people? Yeah, I'm <coughs> sorry, I'm doing this on my computer because I'm uh, just like, uh, well, have put my camera somewhere, I think it's at school, <laughs> for a project I'm working on. We'll be on YouTube soon, I'll tell you more about that later, but hey, yeah, the eye coffin first. It's really, wow, different, yeah, I seriously... An eye coffin. Wow, I'm pretty stunned right now. And she bought this. Well, Karma's mom bought this for me because, well, hey, her Karma's mom is very nice and is my mom's best friend right now. So, uh, yeah, I'm totally liking this right now. I got an eye coffin. So yeah, I'm gonna take it out of the box and show you what it is, basically. So I'll be back in a uh, few minutes, and I think Karma will be back then as well, in screenshot, looking what I'm doing, and so I'll see you then. Hi, oh yeah, there I am again. Um, well, just a second, I'll uh, close the door. Yeah, and that was my mom talking to Carmen's mom about boyfriend issues. I don't get that. Well, um, to be honest, I never had a boyfriend, so I just wouldn't know. Um, and to rephrase that, I don't have a girlfriend either. <laughs> but okay, yeah, this is the eye coffin out of the box. Um, sorry. So yeah, um, well I tried to open it, well, uh, eye coffin itself, to change the batteries because apparently they died. <laughs> so, but I can't find the right screwdriver for it right now, so I have to do that in a later video. But I will do it, <laughs> not like the last time. I said I would make a review on um, Rock Shell, the Gargoyle, I can't pronounce her last name <laughs> because I keep forgetting it. <laughs> I should learn that out of my head, but yeah. So here it is, the eye coffin, and you can slide it open like that to the keyboard. And I've tried to look it up on YouTube how many people may review on it. So if you really want to know what it does until I get my next movie out, well, review on eye coffin, how it works, how you play with it, that kind of stuff. Um. 
you can just look it up on YouTube, say Monster High, Eye Coffin Review, and then you get a whole bunch, a list of people who did one. But yeah, I think it's pretty cool. Um, but I was going to think of repainting the pink bits because I'm not the type of person who likes pink. I would have liked blue better, but that's me. But yeah. But that's just still a question in my head if I could repaint or if, should I repaint it or not. I was thinking of doing it blue or something, a kind of a dark blue or a purple, a bit of a royal purple. Those are the two main colors that I like. So um yeah. It I won't decide now yet, but it's it's debatable. Maybe I won't paint it, but yeah. Uh, so yeah, that's the eye coffin. Um, you've all also heard me talk about I lost my camera or misplaced it, and well, my thought is maybe it could be at school. Well, I was gonna talk about that more in the first part before I unbox the eye coffin. Well, this project for school. And well, in Dutch, it's called Media Weisheit. Well, just start at the beginning. I am doing a DTP. Um, uh, God, I'm losing the word here. Uh, DTP. Something. Um, well, I'm doing that for well, my school. In Dutch, it's opleiding or something like that. Um, so yeah, I'm doing DTP, desktop publishing, making flyers, folders, that kind of stuff. I think you people have heard it already. So yeah, for uh, this class called Media Weisheit, we've been asked uh, in groups of four to um, make a video of maybe three to four minutes, and it could be could be on any subject you want and uh... Well, I'm in this group of four people uh, there's me there's Jennifer, a friend of mine um... she's older, uh, she's 23 to be exact I actually made a request for her for the thousand years of Disney mashup or something like that um, so yeah that's also on YouTube um, also, I made it, she made another request of Doctor Who. Uh, just a. Hey, see ya. Bye. See ya. Love ya. Love you too. Yeah, that's my friend mom's friend leaving. Um, so yeah, uh, Doctor Who. Also, in the request list. Um. And there's also Ava. She's also on YouTube. She's Smiley Miley Nubus X. And Beaver Dated Love, her vlog channel. And I'm saying hi to you, Ava. And also another girl called CM. Sorry, just a second. I'll close the door because my mom is very loud. You're very loud. Uh, you talking about? Mm -hmm. Yeah, my mom asking me if I found my out stupid chair. I'm stuck, people. Okay, let's do it this way then. Um, asking me if I find my camera. Um, well, no, to be exact. So yeah, and the fourth girl is C Dem. C Dem doesn't really want to be on camera, so it's about three characters, to be exact. And so, yeah, we, uh, the three of us, um, four of us, to be exact, are going to make a movie from three to five minutes. And um, it, it could be about any subject you wanted. And, well, me, Jennifer, and she, them, are the most... Well, we like anime and that kind of stuff. I actually made my own uh, card kept Sakura staff. I'll make a review on that. 
took me a week to make that. That was pretty cool. Um, so yeah, and uh, Jennifer's kind of game freak there. <laughs> but going on to the subject is, um, Sedum's going to do the camera work. Um, well, Ava is going to be the lead. She's going to play a kind of princess type of thingy. Um, I lost to Jennifer of being the good guy versus the bad guy. I lost with rock, paper, scissors, and I got to be the bad guy. Yeah, that is new. Me, the bad guy. I've never thought of me in that way, to be exact. But yeah, so Jennifer's going to be the good guy. And, um, well, we also made a Twitter on it for it because that was also part of the lesson. We had to make a Facebook account for it and a uh, Twitter account so we can say launch information about it. I'll la leave the Twitter account name on, um, well, in the description to be exact. And so, uh, yeah, this project is called, well, Project Damsel Ava pretty weird. Yeah, um, yeah, Damsel Ava is about Ava being, well, haunted by me. <laughs> yeah, I mean, about that. Yeah. Um, yeah, to say, it, well, in the beginning of the, I'm not going to tell you the whole storyline, <laughs> that'll be a bit cheating. So, if you want, interested about this, and it's going to be very funny, it's going to be kind of comedy thing, um, go watch it, I say, go look on Twitter or on Facebook, and, um, look for more information about it, and, uh, yeah, um, so, also, part of the lesson was, if it was good enough, because if we had so many reviews, or, sorry, computers when down there, um, black, because I wasn't doing anything, I was just talking to you, <laughs> um, uh, god, I, I missed my flow there, uh, I was talking about that, <laughs> yeah, if we, we had so many reviews, and the highest reviews on this video were, will come on TV, um, on a Dutch channel called Salto, because, the people we get the lesson from, Media Value Sites, they work for IMTV. And I think they also said it was going to be on their site, IMTV. So, and also another part, nothing to do with lesson, but I'm going to help them out, IMTV, of showing them nice places in uh, Amsterdam. And I'm going to do where I live. Um, so I'm going to be on TV. <laughs> but yeah, going on, uh, well, back to the subject. Yeah, that's, um, there's going to be a movie, and, well, it's going to be a very funny movie. And we're going to upload, or at least I will upload, a extra video with bloopers. Because we're, yeah, you're bound to have bloopers. So, and they're going to be very funny. <laughs> So, yeah. Um, and, well, this is a project of four weeks. And, um, yeah, we had last week our first day of, well, filming. And we had to walk to our location in our outfits. Don't do that. Seriously, don't go already in your outfit. We got weird comments, seriously. Um, we were filming outside of our school. Well, kind of behind our school. But they were building there. And building people are not the nicest people to talk to. Yeah, you get nice comments from, uh, hey, look at that, look at that parade. So, yeah. And I have to... And we have to do that next week as well. That's going to be very fun. And another side note, I cannot run on high heels. <laughs> I don't really wear high heels, but hey, I wear kind of 
You'll see it in the movie if you'll see my legs. So, yeah. It um, was pretty weird doing that. But yeah, look for more information about that movie. And, yeah, I'll uh, keep you up posted on this and I'll make a movie like this face to face talk to you about it and um... well I hope you will uh, it was a very short review but I wanted to share you uh, share this information with you and yeah I hope you liked the review there's gonna be a um, kind of second part to it so until then I hope you liked it and look for the rest of the information of the movie so that was Miss Cool Cat 14. See you all next time. To the next review. <laughs> I am just falling right now. I should shut up. <laughs>